Taylor number nine. Taylor. At Stamford Bridge. Then, ten minutes from time, Taylor struck again to put the hammers through to Wembley in John Lyle's first season as team manager. It, it really is a bit of a special dream come true for you. I mean, you, you get your first match against Arsenal and you score two goals. You get two in the semi-final. Yeah, I think I've come a long way this year, big step up, but I think there are still lads who help me tremendously. Well done. Cheers. <laughs> 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 you got you got the party line in. Billy Jennings screaming for the ball, hitting it first time. Miller gets it. Taylor turns it back. Yes, Alan Taylor. Holland. Oh, what a good ball by Holland there for Patton, and hit well by Patton number two. And he's done it again. Alan Taylor. Well, that's how West Ham did it. And amongst our guests today, we've got the man, the young man in the final analysis who did it for them, Alan Taylor. That's got to be a dream come true, really, yesterday, hasn't it? Yes, it's something special in my life. Because you started the season in the fourth division with Rochdale. Yeah, yeah. And what sort of crowds were you playing in front of there? Um, well, on the league day, I would say, at the most, about 1,700. 1,700? Yeah. Did yesterday affect your nerves at all? Um, I think when I first went out to have a look at the pitch, when we went to the West Ham end and all the crowd, it got me a bit then, but I calmed down as we went out. Mm. Yeah, Lampard, put out a little bit there by Coppel's pace, but uh, then very skillfully finding Mervyn there. Tremendous kick that Day has got, and Taylor is after it, and he might get there! Yes! And Taylor! And they were caught out absolutely wide open! The simplest goal you can imagine, the most elementary mistake you can imagine, and it puts West Ham 1-0 in the lead. And now Billy Bonds. Onside! He timed his run well, Coleman, and Keith Robson is coming in fast also. But he couldn't quite play it the first time. He might the second to Alan Taylor. Yes! First time's throw. Kevin Locke to Keith Robson. Locke again. Hit in first time and hit in well. Billy Jennings right in there. Taylor there! Goal given! No, offside. Is it offside? No, it's a goal. It's hot. And Arthur Blossom before the goal then kick. There you go! Conroy with Lampard at him. No foul. Bill Barnes for West Ham. Holland. Patton. Tommy Taylor calling for it. Back for Coleman. In again for Patton. It's McGiven. Lampard. In. That's a good one for Brooking. And that is 2-1. And Alan Taylor got the finishing touch to that one. That was a beautiful little goal. Gorgeously constructed. So simple. Well, the ball going straight to Alan Taylor. He's found Radford. In turn, looking for Billy Jennings. Donald right back there, Brooking playing it on, good ball played there for Alan Taylor. This will be the equaliser, and it is for Alan Taylor. 1-1. Nice turn. The pass to Jennings, the touch for Brooking. Up to Lukowski, has come up quickly on this side. Here he is, Lampard's gone up as well to join him. That's the ball aimed for Frank Lampard. Armstrong shrugged off that ball by Lampard. Good cross! Oh, and a brilliant goal! Brilliant West Ham goal by Alan Taylor. 3-2 into the lead. Good pass. Oh, obviously to Robson. Holland is onside. Oh, Jennings, it must be an equaliser. Yes, it is by Alan Taylor. Four minutes of the second half gone. Losing out to Tommy Taylor. And now Brooking is away. Rice sticking with him. 
A chance for the cross. It's a useful looking one. Back in from David Cross. And West Ham get the goal they want. And it's Alan Taylor who gets it. Just three minutes into the second half.